Hello. Hello, everybody. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. <sighs> How is everybody? How am I? Well, I'm not good. Well, This will likely be my last broadcast. And it's going to be painful for all of you. It's going to be very painful. And I'm sorry. I'm telling you ahead of time. Just to let you know. <clears throat> um, um. I've spent the last three years enmeshed in finding the darkness in the world and uncovering the darkness in the world, but not enough time uncovering the darkness within me. And the dog said too, I made a really stupid, cynical, petty, stupid decision this week. And I did it in the blink of an eye. And with as much time as I've spent trying to mitigate risk, uh, and there were a lot of people that I kept out of my life, that I wanted in my life, but I didn't want to bring harm to them because of all the Illuminati shit. Um, and this struggle against darkness, this struggle against darkness consumed me it consumed me. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a bad guy. I'm a bad guy. I'm a bad guy. I let the darkness consume me. And I I didn't spend enough time nurturing the light and love within me. Thank you. I let down some really great people and it was my desire to serve these people, but that desire was not born out of a love that is pure. Don't get me wrong, children deserve to live in a world where they are treated well. I was not treated well. Jesus. Jesus came from heaven to earth to die for our sins. Yeah, he did. And I have done a disservice to God. I've done a disservice to America. I've done a disservice to uh, a lot of people. And honestly, I, uh, I don't expect anyone will ever Did I hurt a child? No, I didn't hurt a child. Uh, no, I didn't do that. I spent a lot of time avoiding the really big evil stuff, right? Uh, the big evil stuff is easy. It's easy to avoid, right? We know that hurting children is hard. Uh, we know that uh, killing people is did I screw someone over? Yeah, I did. I screwed over, I screwed over America. I screwed over everybody, to be honest. Uh, and it happened in the blink of an eye. I didn't kill anyone, no. <clears throat> no, I'm not being threatened. And this is very, uh, it's been hard to do. I've been meditating all week, thinking about stuff. Uh, 
I know, how is it possible? Let's talk about Judas. Judas, let's talk about Judas. Judas loved Jesus. Judas fought for Jesus. But in the end, Judas betrayed Jesus. And it was a flippant, petty, vile decision. And it's happened again. I took some bait. I did take some bait. The truth is, the truth is, there was a lot of, uh, there was a lot of work that went into making me do it, or inducing, inducing, inducing me to do what I did. And I didn't see it. And I was overcome by ego. I was overcome by just petty, petty greed. What, not even, just stupid, absolutely stupid decision. And I, therefore, am a traitor. I am a traitor. And it happened in the blink of an eye. And I, uh, I don't know how it happened. Well, I do know how it happened. I can tell you exactly how it happened. Uh, I accessed some very high levels of consciousness. And then right away, I went way low to conscious. I went way, 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 way low. And the truth is, the answer was in front of me the whole time, but I was too fucking stupid. I was too stupid to see what I was and what I had become. I, uh... You know, the last, I've spent a lot, I've been alone. I've been alone. I've been, I've been uh, not nurturing myself. I've been not connecting to my heart and not connecting to good and doing what is good. I exposed a lot of bad guys and now I'm exposing myself. I'm exposing myself. Yep. And everyone out there, let this be a warning to you uh, to not give in to darkness. Don't give in to darkness. Don't give in. And here's, here's the thing, again. The big stuff, the big stuff that you do, it's easy to avoid that because you see it. But the little stuff, the little stuff, it just creeps up on you. And if you're not vigilant, and if you're not in your in you in in a, in a state of love if you're not in a state of love and care then you can make bad decisions <clears throat> is this uh no so it's really bad it's really bad guys it's really fucking bad it's really bad and i f ugh, i can't uh I'm not being told to say this. I'm doing it of my own free will. And I told a very good man, a very good man. I told him that I would try to use this situation and I would uh, try to utilize it so that people may learn something about themselves. Yeah? I want them, I, I want to serve, I want my bad decisions to serve as a guide of what not to do. You don't understand what I'm saying. Yeah, I know. It's, uh, it's unconscionable. It's so stupid. It's, uh, it's really dumb. And it happened in the blink of an eye. And it was, guys, it was ooh, so fucking dumb what I did. So fucking dumb. So fucking dumb. Am I one of them? Now I am. Now I am. Now I'm one of them. Now I'm one of them. Those people that I was so concerned with finding and rooting out, right? Because of the darkness. But that darkness, I didn't use it to see my own light. I just let the darkness consume me. And in the beginning, when I came out, when I came out in the beginning, 
uh, that was in a place of uh, bravery and love. But then it just, it, it became, I became, uh, my anger at these people, these people, my anger consumed me. And I didn't have a good grip on my anger. I didn't, I, I just let it seep inside. Self-sabotage. Yeah, self-sabotage indeed. Self-sabotage like you've never fucking seen, folks. Uh, just awful, awful stuff. And uh, I have betrayed all of you. Uh, I've betrayed everybody. I've betrayed everybody. And I... I was a good guy, and I, you know what? Here's the thing, you can be a good person, like, look, we all have different levels of darkness and light within us, um, but if you are susceptible to the dark for just one instant, just one instant, then you, you can destroy everything you've worked for. You can destroy everything you've worked for. Did I choose to be bad? How bad is it on scale of one to 10? I would say easy 10. Um, was it drug induced? No, it wasn't drug induced. It was ego induced and it was uh, cynically induced. And it was, it was a lot of things. It was a lot of things. And the truth is, I haven't been practicing self-care. I haven't been loving myself. I haven't... Uh, I haven't... I haven't been... I haven't been holding the light within me. I haven't been holding the light. And... I made a really, really like the most stupid decision. They will write books about this decision and how fucking dumb it is. And I had nothing to gain. Did I lie about Seth Green? No, Seth Green's a pedophile. Uh, <clears throat> am I afraid of something? I'm afraid of... Uh, no, I, well, I, I should be because bad things are coming my way. I can assure you of that. Um, uh, I don't think that's actually true, Pachyderm Princess. There's not hope. Because I crossed a line that I shouldn't have crossed. And, uh... It's, it's a decision that will forever... Forever... You'll, you'll remember it forever. Uh, really dumb, really dumb. No, I didn't take a satanic vow. I did not take a satanic vow. Redemption is with Christ. Yes, redemption is with Christ. And redemption is, uh, redemption is earned. And it takes a lot of time. And the true spirit of Christ is to find the light within. And I ignored that light and I fed into darkness and uh, framed me. Uh, I wouldn't say framed, although I will say uh, very, there's a lot of, there's a lot of work that went into it. I'm always worthy of redemption. Well, I hope to be, I sure hope to be, um, I hope to be. I hope to be. And what I've been doing this week is just reviewing my decisions and what I've done in my life. And especially recently. Uh, and taking a good hard look at it and being honest with myself. Like, why did I do the things that I did? Why did I do it? I'll never be bad in your eyes. Well, I hope that you can remember the good that I've the good that I've brought. I hope you can I hope that you can remember the love that I showed you. Going to miss the brackets and jackets? Yeah, well, the bracket tolls for the Is Q going to bracket my initials? Probably, yeah. Probably. Yeah, most likely. 
I did something really dumb. I'm not suicidal. I'm not suicidal. Did I do it for money? Yeah. Uh, man, it's bad. It's so dumb. It's so fucking dumb. I'm not going to tell you what I did because uh, at this point, it still could endanger people. And I don't want to do that. So, can you help me? You can pray for my soul. You can, um, you can pray for me. And you can, you can, you, know, you can pray and you can pray. You're, guys, it's so important. It's so important to take the time to find the light and stay in the light. Yeah. It's very sad, guys. It's really sad. It's really sad. I've done a huge disservice. A huge, like the most... The good guys are always watching, ready to embrace me. Oh, they're ready to embrace me now. They're definitely ready to embrace me. Who did it affect? Well, I don't want to go into it. It's bad. It's so dumb. And, uh... I just, just like that, guys. It's just like that. It's just like that. A blink of an eye. Blink of an eye, you can do something so dumb and so stupid that uh, it fucks you forever. Yeah, it's really bad, Miner. It's really fucking bad. It's really bad. Is this my last broadcast? Yeah, it probably will be. It probably will be. It probably will be. And I feel, I, I've, I saw all the love outpouring towards me in the messages. And, uh, it's made me feel really badly. Did I put any of you in danger? Um, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plead insanity? Well, I have been under a lot of fucking stress and PTSD, but at the end of the day, uh, I made some choices. And uh, I fucked up. I fucked up badly. Very, very badly. So... I want you to remember the light that I showed you. And I want you to remember the love that I showed you because people aren't gonna like me. They're not, they're gonna think I'm the worst thing ever. And I did something really bad and dumb. <sighs> oh. Will we find out? You'll find out soon enough. You'll find out soon enough. How bad is it and why would I sell out? Why would I sell out? Good fucking question. Because I always said I would never sell out for a bunch of money. Like I wouldn't. I would just not do it. Right? But it turns out I did it for much less. Like a ridiculous... It's, it's on the par of Judas. It's so awful, guys. I know. You're sick. I'm sick. We're all sick. I did not join the Illuminati. Is Vegan Mikey okay? I don't know. I haven't talked to him. I hope he's okay. What did I, was done because someone manipulated? Well, that's where we're getting into a little... There are some things that induced the decision. Am I going to leave the country? I might. I might. Yeah, I might. Something bad is about to happen? Yeah, something bad's about to happen. The truth will set you free. The truth is I did something so cynical and so petty and so selfish. So just stupid, guys. So dumb. So dumb. 
And uh, I could have avoided it very fucking easily, very easily, but I didn't. And uh, for that, I will pay. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> <clears throat> do I need legal advice? No, I don't. I don't need legal advice. Do you need to prepare? Yeah, you need to prepare with the feeling of being betrayed by someone you love, which would be me. So... But I, I told someone very great, a very great person, that I would use this experience to try and transmute what I did in the blink of an eye. Just, that's all it takes, guys. All it takes is a blink of an eye, and you can... Have I spoken to Jesus? Yeah, I may have. I may have. Does it have to do with getting my music out? No. And that's, guys, here's the thing. I encountered so much hardship and so much just crap. And uh, I let it, I let it tear me apart and I let it slow me down. I did not overcome. I did not overcome. I just let it destroy me while fixated on the darkness. So there you go. And, uh... Everyone makes bad decisions. Well, not like this one. <sighs> Am I a liar? No, I'm not a liar. Well, does it have to do... No, it doesn't have to do with behavior. I will tell you this. Junior is going to change the world. And he's very, very in touch with the light. It's going to be great. And it's a shame that I'm going to miss it. It's a shame that I'm going to miss it. Because I was so stupid. So stupid. Where am I going? Well... Uh, uh, Junior JFK, yep, Junior JFK. Jesus was sent for our sins so that we could find the darkness within us, right? That's why Jesus was sent. You're deleting your Periscope now, yeah, no, not Paris. You and your children are not in danger, you're fine. You're fine. Someone's telling you to say, no, no, someone wasn't telling me to say this, but I talked to a man, a very good man, a very, very good man. And I told him, I was like, uh, he's like, dude, this is retarded. I'm like, I know. But I would like to use this to further the light. Am I deleting this scope? No, I'm going to leave it up. I'm going to leave it up. I have to leave it up. I was always brave. Um, I was always brave, but stupid. Stupid. Stupid people put other people in harm's way. Stupid people. <sighs> make other people uh, lose. Am I in danger? Yeah, I'm in danger. But only because of myself. Only because of myself. This is a blow to the awakening. Yeah, it really fucking is, guys. It really is. It really is. And it's all my fault. It's all my fault. So...
I apologize to everyone. Goodbye. No goodbye. No. Goodbye. Embrace the light's heat. I betrayed a trust is what I did. I betrayed a trust in a really petty way. A really petty way. Yes, yeah, see you later. I hope to, you know what? I've been thinking a lot. I hope to come back into this world. And I hope to come back into this world. with a desire to with a desire to find the light within and serve others. And more importantly, uh, care of the self. I woke you up to a new level. Well, you know, uh, I, I feel like I've done a lot of good. I've done a lot of good, and I have been really brave. I have been brave, but the darkness consumed me. Whose trust? Uh, everybody's. Everybody. Everybody. I know everyone loves me, and that's why it feels so shit. Because I've betrayed you all. And uh, I'm, no, I'm not a patriot. I'm not a patriot. I was a patriot, but I'm not anymore. Can you forgive me? I hope you can. I hope you can find it in your hearts to forgive me. I hope that you can realize that, uh, I hope that you can realize that although I have a lot of light inside, I also have a lot of darkness and I didn't tend to the darkness Thank you, Pachyderm Princess. I didn't tend to the darkness, guys. I didn't, I didn't make peace with it, and I didn't learn how to come to the light, right? How are you going to find out? I don't know, maybe, uh, maybe this will get, maybe Q will post this. Uh, you're shocked, I'm shocked too. I'm shocked too, guys, I'm shocked too. <sighs> Temptation is a motherfucker. Temptation is a motherfucker, guys. Temptation is a motherfucker. And if it's something little, uh, and you do it, and then don't think about the consequences and, like, who might be affected by your decision, then you're fucked. How, when did this happen? It happened this week. Happened this week. Did I put Fiona in danger? No, I didn't put Fiona in danger. Uh, no, it'll be newsworthy. Yeah, no. You feel sick. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. 
Did I put you in danger? Yeah. 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 Don't give in to cynicism, guys. Don't give in to, to sin. It will pass. Eh, well, it's only going to get worse from here for me, I'm afraid. Guardian angels are important. They are. Guardian angels are important. Am I doing this scope for a reason? Yeah, I am. I'm doing it for the reason that... Uh, you know, there's a, a lot of people who've done bad shit, and they don't, they just lie and avoid the bad shit. They, uh, they don't want to fess up. They don't want to fess up. They don't want to, uh, tell the truth. But I came here to tell the truth. Because like I said, I told a really great man that I would use my folly, five minutes of folly, to to transmute it to transmute and use this experience yeah no one is safe from this matrix well it's all about, guys, I deleted everything on my Instagram because I'm going to get a lot of hate. I'm going to get a lot of hate. A lot of hate is coming my way. A lot of anger is coming my way. And it's deserved. It's deserved. <laughs> yeah, I don't think uh, that would happen. Style someone. Are we living in the end times? No, we're living in the beginning times. We are living in the beginning of a great new age. And it's a shame that uh, I w will be probably not around for the first part of it. Uh, it's a shame. I let some people down. Really, really, really down. So basically, you will hate me. Yeah, you might, you might hate me. You might hate me. You might learn to hate me. You're sorry this is happening. I'm sorry too. I'm sorry I betrayed you. Sorry I betrayed you. Thanks, broads. Thank you, Pachyderm Princess. Thank you. You know my heart. You know my heart, but I don't always remember my heart and remember to stay in my heart. And that's the problem. So I didn't stay in my heart. Should you defend the allegations? No, don't defend the allegations. Um, no, don't defend the allegations. Am I alone? Yeah, I'm alone. I'm alone right now. How can you help? How can you help? You can pray and meditate and reflect on your decisions and your actions. And... 
do it in truthfully in a place of love and acceptance. Here's the thing, like, you can just switch right back into a higher awareness and you'll be fine. But you have to stay there. If you, if you fall lower, if you fall into a lower awareness, you will, uh, you might make some bad decisions. Yeah, you might make some bad decisions and compromise yourself. <sighs> mm. See, all right, here's, <laughs> so here's, Tree says, how about we all come over and place, to your place and give you a big hug and keep you safe? Well, I would like that. However, uh... I wouldn't want to do that because it might put you in danger and I don't want to put you in danger. And that's called making a smart decision. We all make bad decisions. Well, this one's a whopper, folks. A real fucking whopper. Am I in danger? Yeah, I am in danger and it's all my fault. Yep. Oh. No, no one's threatening me. No one's threatening me. I'm not under duress right now. I, I'm doing this in a place of service. Doing this in a place of service because when you want to serve others, you're in the light. But not serving others at the expense of your... Uh, your body, your integrity. I need a movie. Mm. Well, I'm sure they'll make a movie about me. You're not in harm's way. You're going to be fine. Yes, Pachyderm Princess says, Mind your dreams, fam. Mind your dreams. Rede reject Dark Otto's suggestion. Yes, and I will tell you that some things were planted inside my consciousness. Uh, and they went on repeat. Check your tweets from this morning. I will look up your tweets from this morning. <clears throat> I'll look it up right now. have to find those tweets when I get off because I can't get on the Twitter here. Where we go one, we go all. Yep, and I decided to go a different direction. Just for a blink of an eye. Um... Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to use this time to reflect and to pray and to come into the light. 
because I fell out at a really inopportune time. Pray for me. Pray for each other, but more, most importantly, pray for yourself. And when I say pray for yourself, it's not about, God, uh, make, make me better. Make me better. It's not about that. No. It's about using awareness to find within the dark things that can motivate you. Who put me up to this? I told a very good man that I would do this uh, as a service to everyone. So, have I been misleading you? No. I don't know. I haven't been lying to you. So this will be uh, this will be a blow to a lot of people. People are going to be sad. So I want you to be there for them and tell them that this fight is noble, and this fight is good, and this fight is very important was a very important thing to do. Very, very important. Thank you, Packeter and Princess. I appreciate it. So, even though people will be pretty bummed out by this shit, they'll be bummed out by me and be like, what a fucking idiot, what a stupid man. Uh, know that I'm not always stupid, just stupid enough to do dumb shit. So. You are being watched. I'll tell you this, you're being watched at a level that is pretty crazy. Pretty crazy from within your mind. This isn't about the Illuminati, but yes, fuck the Illuminati. Anyone that hurts children can fuck off forever. That's just like unconscionable. But speaking of which, maybe you've hurt a child in a past life. Did I astral travel to the wrong place? Well, I'll tell you what I did. I'll tell you what I did. I went to a level of awareness uh, very, very high level of awareness. But then right after, I slipped back and went way to a low awareness. Q says there will there will be those we thought were good but turn out bad. Yeah, he did. And uh, little did I know that I would probably end up being one of those people. I didn't know that. I was just uh, foolish and not uh, looking within and not embracing the light within. Instead, consumed with the darkness outside. And what, what I should have been doing was embracing the light within. So... We all make mistakes. Well, this is a whopper, folks. This is heavy. I know, it's so heavy. It's so heavy and so shitty. And yeah, shame. It's a shame. Did I make this up? No, I didn't make it up. I didn't make it up. Did I tell my mom? No, but I called my mom and told her I loved her.
here's the thing though, as people of Earth, right? The kingdom of God is within you. And it lives within you for as long as you embrace it and hold it and let it live within you. When you let it fall out, you're not in the kingdom of God anymore, right? Praying for me, the good guys win. Yeah, the good guys do win. The good guys do win. Mind your dreams, everyone. Mind your dreams. And I, something is coming. There's a, a there's a great light that is coming. So make sure that you are worthy of being in that light. Yeah. Make sure you are worthy of the light. Dimensional transition. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The coming of Christ. Could be. Could be. In a lot of ways, I think this is a mirror of an ancient story. And in a lot of ways, I think it almost had to happen this way. As the mirror. Yeah, pretty much, T1. Pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, I may have. I may have. I may have. Humanity is going to be fine. It's going to be fucking great. It's going to be awesome. And I hope to come back and join you someday. I hope to come back and join you. Was I at the Met Gala? No, I was not at the Met Gala. Guys, I've been alone for the last, uh, for a while, for a while. And it was hard for me to really get into a sense of service to others while so alone. Uh, I should have been using the alone time to pray every day, but instead I was just going at it, finding the darkness, finding, looking, looking for the darkness, you know? And if you look too hard for the darkness, eventually it just kind of seeps in. So... I'm going to be praying and what level of darkness? Here's the thing about darkness, okay? Darkness can come in the flash, it looks like a, and it looks like a uh, trivial thing. You know, because you're not thinking about it. Um, thanks, Salty Sarge. I don't know that that will be an option, but I appreciate it. When is this scope going to end? I don't know. Good question. I'm just going to keep going till. Keep going. We just want goodness for the world. And I wanted goodness for the world. I wanted goodness for the world, but did not focus enough on finding the goodness within myself. I broke your hearts. Yep. Yep. Guys, you're being tested right now. Everyone's being tested. And hopefully this message will get to you in a way that you can 
utilize it. Your loyalty is being tested. Your loyalty is being tested in a big way, folks. Your loyalty is being tested in a big way. So, whose judgment do I fear? Well, loyalty is to God. God and also the light within. The light within, okay? God is not some like external concept, right, that you pray to as an idol. God is God is God lives within all of us. God lives within all of us, okay? God lives within all of us and uh you have to well, here's the thing. God doesn't live within all of us. It doesn't live within you if you are ignoring that. And if you are, you know, caught up in dumb shit, right? God lives within me. It does. And uh, I got right back into the spot. You know, you can get there whenever you want. You just have to hold it. And in, in the moment, in the present, right? In the present present because all you ever have is the present that's all you ever have so you must hold god in your heart in every moment that is how that's how you find it right that's how you find it but you must listen right you have to listen to the voice within No, I don't think so, T1. I don't think so. Well, mm. maybe. <laughs> Must see ourselves as scientists in a laboratory. Yeah. Yeah. Science of spirits. The science of spirits, guys. I'm giving you panic vibes. Don't be panicked. All right, don't panic, don't panic. Whatever you do, don't panic. Panic is giving in to darkness. When you're in God's light, there is no panic. There's no rush, right? Like I feel it now, right now, right now I feel, I feel it. I feel the love of God in my heart right now. The journey is in, the journey is within, the journey is within. Guys, the journey is within. The journey is within us. Mm -hmm. This should not end, but transform it into more light than hate and judgment of others. Yes. Yes, so much that. So much that. And uh, that's why I'm here. All right? That's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. Because we, we need to let go of anger and... And, uh, well, not let go, but integrate anger, because anger is normal. You just have to be like, oh, I'm getting angry, and then, you know, transmute it into something positive, right? Spin it into something positive. And that's why I'm here. I want to spin this into something positive. Am I going to tell you, or am I going to let you hear it? Uh, it's, it's like the worst, it's so stupid, it's so dumb, and so flippant, and so petty, and so, uh, it's really dumb, it's fucking stupid, 
So, like the stupidest, the stupidest. Are you comped? No, you're not comped. You're fine. Yeah, don't, you don't have to ask me. I'm sure you'll find out. I'm sure you'll find out. Thanks, I love you too. On the news, could be. We'll see. We shall see. Thanks, Ink Slinger. I'm worrying you? Well, uh, don't be worried. Just be like, wow, Isaac was a really good dude until he gave into darkness. And uh, he didn't hold the light. And something happened in the blink of an eye, really. And he fucked up. If not money. Yeah, it's money related. Uh, so stupid. So flippant. Darkness. The darkness within, guys. The darkness is within. Darkness exists within, just as light exists within, okay? We all have the capacity for darkness and for light. Yeah. So, you must choose the light. Choose the light. And it's every moment is a choice. Every moment is a choice to go to the dark or go to the light, right? And what you choose Choose to be in the light. I didn't take money. I gambled on something stupid flippantly just because I was like, oh, look at that. Without thinking. Without thinking, guys. Without fucking thinking. Without thinking. If you are a smart person, you think about the uh, outcome of your choices, right? That's what smart people do. And even though the signs were in front of me, I didn't, well, I didn't listen to them. And I let the darkness take over me. Yep, exactly. Exactly, Anna. So dumb. I'm telling the lesson that you need to learn. Yeah, I am. I'm telling the lesson that you need to learn. That's why I'm here. I'm here to share my truth, right? So that you might integrate it. Who else knows? Well, probably everyone. Everyone knows. All the important people know. When you did whatever you did, did I know it was wrong at the time? No! I did not, and that's the thing, because it was it happened so quickly. I didn't think about it. I did not think about it. I didn't think about it. I didn't I didn't contemplate on it. Right? When did I realize? Very fucking soon after. So soon after 
And uh, I undid it real quick, and I was like, oh shit, that was dumb, right? It happened like, my the realization was quick. The realization was quick. Yeah. But the decision is what mattered. And I chose poorly. Hello, Aurora. Digital. Yeah, there's digital trace. Digital. Yep, I told you, and I'm, I didn't lie. So, I got that going for me. I, I don't want to reveal it because uh, harm could be done from it. So, there are no shortcuts to enlightenment. Enlightenment is of the moment. No shit. That's so true, 812. That's so true. There are no shortcuts to enlightenment. It takes years. Years and years and years and years of conscious praying and meditation and contemplation. Which I was not doing. I wasn't doing. I uh, I was not doing it. Yeah. Who are you to put judgment upon, Cappy? Yeah, I mean, that's a good question. Who are you to put judgment on anyone, really? It's like we all err. To err is human. No, I'm not talking about Zims. It's not about Zims. Am I being blackmailed? No, I'm not being blackmailed. Nope. I come here on my own volition. Was I tempted by someone I trusted? Yeah. Yeah. It was pretty elaborate, to be honest. But I chose the wrong thing. I chose the wrong thing, guys. Was it a trap? Mm. Uh. Having to do, well, I don't want to, I don't want to. I don't want to elaborate any further on the act, like the technical of it, just because uh, it could still jeopardize things, and I don't want to do that. What would, advice would you give your son if you had one, if he was in the exact situation? Well, I would hope that if I had a son, that I could teach him to be a better person than I am, and to embrace the love within and to find the light. And again, guys, I'm so sorry that uh, this is going to break your heart. It's going to break your heart. What would Jesus do? Sage words. By the way, if you ever have a decision... Ask yourself, what would Jesus do? What would Jesus do? That's important. If I would have asked myself that question in the moment, then I wouldn't have done what I did. Because it would have been like, oh, what would Jesus do? Not the fucking that. So there you go. What would Jesus do? Good question, guys. What would Jesus do? Ask yourself. Ask yourself what Jesus would do. It's a good way to live. He'd die for you. Yeah. And you know what? At the beginning when I came out, I said, I'm willing to fucking die for this. Which is true. But was I willing to live in the light for this? That's a different question. That's a different question. And the awakening, 
you know, I externalized awakening to like awaken to what's going on all around us. Cause guys, I'm not going to, I'm not going to fucking lie to you. My life ooh, has been very fucking stressful since way before I came out, way before I came out. I'm talking about, and the isolation uh, before I came out uh, was happening a lot too, because there's fucking Illuminati's that were like trying to get at me and just PTSD Ville guys, PTSD in a fucking big way. PTSD, stress, yeah. But we choose to be in that stress. You know, we choose to be traumatized by things that happen, yeah. I would say, uh, be very vigilant, guys. Be very vigilant. Very vigilant. Yeah. In your mind, be vigilant with your thoughts, okay? There's no one in the room right now. Can we all, uh, Yeah, it's a shame I took it down. I just... Uh, comments. I want people to remember the good that I did and not just the really one stupid fucking thing. Well, not just one. I've done a lot of stupid things, but... One was really bad. Focus on love. That's right, guys. Focus on love. Energy flows where focus goes. Energy flows where focus goes, all right? Right, energy goes where focus, so focus on love. Focus on love, loving each other. You're loving yourself and holding the light within. Something about a karaoke bar? No, nothing about a karaoke bar. So. Yeah, you could probably find it. You could probably find it. You already did? Yeah, you already did. You feel like you're going to puke. I'm sorry, guys. I betrayed you guys. I, uh, and it happened in the blink of an eye. Yeah. Have I been involved with children? No, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't hurt children. So. I'm going to end this scope for now. Maybe I'll do another one. We'll see. Um, I need to. The devil will put his hooks in on all of us whenever and wherever he can. That's true, guys. The devil uh, will. Yeah, the devil will. But the devil, okay, the devil can only tempt you into something. You have the choice. If you stay in the light, then it's all right. I'm sorry, Anna. I'm so sorry. 
I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Call on Jesus for help. Oh, I will. I will. I will. Ponzi? No, not Ponzi. Just dumb. Just stupid. Just stupid. So dumb. So dumb. So dumb. So foolish. Threw it all away. But again, I think that this may have been... All humans make mistakes. That's true, all humans make mistakes. Hopefully not super big ones. I may have been MK Ultra. Yeah, well, I will tell you, there was some things that happened that were not normal as far as like uh, things playing in my head that came from outside. That happened. Yeah, it was not, sh yeah, yeah, it wasn't straightforward, and, uh, yeah, oh, mm, yep, they, uh, that's the thing, that is the thing, Virginia. Archangel of Michael is with, I hope he's with me, I, uh, I hope he's with me. But that's a choice. I mean, if you want Jesus to be with you, you just call upon him and find him in your heart. You're always there. It's true. Thank you, what the heck. Thank you. The degree of, yeah, it is kind of, by the way. It is kind of. If you're targeted at a weak moment and can't control your consciousness. Yeah, that is something to think about. That is something to think about. You're without words? Well, it's all right. Do you believe God's word, the Bible, is the only truth we can truly rely on? There's a lot of truth in the Bible, but also there's a lot of things that aren't totally uh, of the light, I would say. Like where they talk about how you, the, the right way to own slaves, and eh, there's a bunch of other stuff. When will you find out? I don't know. You'll find out when I do, I guess. I'm not, well, I don't think I'm an alien. I don't know. I don't, well, I don't want to do it now because, again, I don't want to get into the specifics. You can't tell what's real right now. I would say, guys, you need to find the fucking light. Yeah? Find the light within, guys. Find the light within. Find the light within. Very important. Very important. And stay in the light. How do you find the light? Uh, it's an awareness. And I think 
the most important is coming from your heart. Yeah? Coming from your heart and just getting into the present. Humble yourselves. Yes, fucking humble yourselves. Stay humble. People say full armor of God, which... I don't know that armor is... Uh, I don't know armor is what you need because armor just keeps stuff out right but you need to let things in the way the truth and the life that's right jesus is the way the truth and the life the way the way is the most important part of that the way how do you stay the way is the moment and becoming attuned to it is q good yeah q's good q's good better than me I mean, yeah, I, well, armor could be good to, like, keep some things out, but the more important thing, I think, is to find the light within. Find the light within. You all have a light within. You're all uh, beings of God, you know? Even the worst among us. Even, like, uh, even the worst among us. Is it possible I may be wrong? Yeah, possible, but, well, there's, there's some things. Kind of weird. Is Q mad at me right now? Yeah, yeah, probably. Mm-hmm. Yeah, people, people are going to be very fucking hurt. People are going to get their feelings hurt. In a big way. Right. So. Physically, no. Well, I'm going to go now, and maybe I'll come back. We'll see. But stay in the light. Stay in the moment. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to go now. I need to eat something. I haven't eaten all day. I've just been praying and meditating, thinking about what I was going to say to you guys. Because you deserve to hear it from me. We've been together through so much. And uh, here we are. So I'm going to go eat. And maybe uh, maybe we'll come back, okay? But I love you. I'm sorry for betraying you. It happened in an instant. I wasn't thinking right. And... Mm, But, yeah, I'm going to just, I'm going to eat and I need to be praying. I need to be praying a lot. So I'm going to do that. Guys, I cannot stress this enough. You need to pray and meditate and you need to contemplate. Can you watch replay? Yeah, I'm going to leave this one up. I'm going to leave this one up. Everyone deserves to hear this message. Integrate your shadow self. Integrate your shadow self, folks. Integrate it. Uh, yeah. Maybe I'll be back in a little bit, though. I'm going to go eat. If I'm not, just know that it was really an honor and a pleasure to serve this movement. And get the word out and the truth out, you know, but 
don't get so focused on the monsters out there that you become one yourself and you let the darkness seep in. Because, guys, once I found out about fucking Pizzagate, uh, I, I was literally work. I Guys, I put thousands of hours into this. Thousands of hours. Like, uh, easily thousands of hours. But what happened? You know? I became so focused with the externalizations of evil that I did not find the evil within and focus on the light. Maybe I'll be back later. I love you. Take care, okay?